Hi guys, welcome to today's lesson. Today I am going to teach you how to make powder detergent. How to make powder detergent. Powder detergent is a mixture of many substances whose individual functions contribute to the overall effectiveness of the detergent as a cleaning agent. The active ingredient in powder detergent is what we call alkyl benzene sulfonate, which is a salt made by reacting sulfonic acid with soda ash. This active ingredient is sometimes called surfactants, which is an acronym for surface active agent. A surface active agent is a substance that can reduce the surface tension of a liquid, making washing with the liquid possible. In the manufacture of powder detergents, the surfactant is first made and then blended with other ingredients in the right proportions. So today we are going to produce about one kilogram of powder detergent using the following recipe. Number one is soda ash, 800 grams. Two sulfonic acid, 120 mils. Sodium tripolyphosphate, 80 grams. Sodium lauryl sulfate, 40 grams. Trans oil, 10 mils. Water soluble colorant, 0 0.3 grams. And colorant is optional. You may choose not to add it to your detergent. And also, there are two types of soda ash. We have light soda ash and dense soda ash. This recipe is for dense soda ash. Now let's see the procedure for making the powder detergent. The first thing you do is pour the soda ash into a plastic bowl or bucket. Pour the soda ash into a plastic bowl or bucket. Two, using a stick blender, pound the soda ash gently and try to crush it into tiny particles. Pound the soda ash gently and try to crush it into tiny particles. Three, add the sulfonic acid. Add the sulfonic acid and mix it with the soda ash thoroughly for about 10 minutes. Add the sulfonic acid to the soda ash and mix it thoroughly. Now the reaction between the sulfonic acid and the soda ash will yield the active ingredient, which is sodium alkyl benzene sulfonate, in our detergent. The next thing is crush the sodium lauryl sulfate in a separate bucket or in a mortar. Crush the sodium lauryl sulfate in a separate bucket or in a mortar into tiny particles and add to the detergent. The next thing is add the sodium tripolyphosphate. Add the sodium tripolyphosphate. Then stir the mixture thoroughly for about five minutes. Stir the mixture thoroughly for about five minutes. The next thing is add a small amount of water to the colorant and dissolve it. Now mix the colorant solution with 
a small portion of the detergent. Mix the colorant solution with a small portion of the detergent and pour it on a waterproof material. That means if you choose to use to add colorant to your product, dissolve it in a small amount of water and mix it with a small portion of the detergent that you are making. All right, and pour it on a waterproof material to dry. The next thing is that you pour the remaining white detergent, pour the remaining white detergent on the same waterproof material and spread it. Expose the two detergents to air for about three weeks. Now after about three weeks, mix the two detergents together as the colored and the white detergent, mix them together in a bucket and add the fragrance to it, add the fragrance to it and mix thoroughly. All right, now put it in a container and cover it for use. Your powder detergent is ready. Thank you very much.